Good morning everyone, this time I'm in the King Air 350 and I will show you in this short tutorial how to use the navigation radios in this airplane. If you know how to use them, please, this is not a video for you. If you don't know how to use them, then this is the video for you. So I'm going to zoom, uh, zoom in into our primary flight display and uh, you can tell this is a touch screen. So we touch in split and that will bring us that will bring the map but the map has these sub menus here so we can touch either fly plan or map go back to map or procedure it's the same menu so once we are in this menu we can either look up for frequencies touching nearest and then nearest VOR and here are the nearest VOR with their frequencies so let's say I want to select 112.2 uh, then I will go back to main menu select nav1 112.2 and hit transfer and that will put this frequency as my active VOR frequency for nav1 radio now you can do the same for uh, other radios nav2 radio let's say I want to tune silvich in nav2 radio 1157 so now that I know the frequency I go to the main menu nav2 frequency and 1157 transfer and that that will put as active frequency if you only want to enter the frequency as a standby to select it later on then let's look for another one let's look for uh, I don't know Riverside 112.4 so let's go in nav actually let me put in nav 1 let me go back and nav 1 I'm I'm gonna enter 1157 so I will go nav 1 1157 and enter hit enter only not transfer so now I have 115.7 as standby for my nav 1 radio so let's go back to full mode now how do I display these radios now you have to click on the HSI here and there it is your bearing pointers so bearing pointer nav 1 Papa Delta Zulu at 16 DME and we are pretty much on radial 229 almost 230 and if I activate bearing pointer 2 uh, sorry bearing pointer 2 that's Silvich Sierra Lima India and I'm straight ahead towards that one I'm in uh, radial 88 so of course 258 will get me sorry radial 78 so course 258 is the inbound course for that one so now let's say I want to select Silvich in my number one radio which I have preset so I will go to split flight plan nav sorry nav one and because it's already there in a standby I only have to hit transfer and that will give me one one Come on, it should be 1157. Okay, let's try one more time. 1157 transfer. That's something, yeah, looks like a little bit of a glitch there, a bug. Looks like this system is still not quite up to speed. But anyway, now we have Silvich in both radios. Now, if I want to go from FMS to navigate via VORs, let me he select heading first. So now I'm going in the heading. And now let's hit here and CDI source to VOR1 and there it is and you hit in the HSI to go back so now let's intercept that uh, radial there and you can do it either manually or you just press nav and now you're navigating to the VOR in course 257 in this case so there is the airplane just capturing the course 257 and navigating towards that VOR. So that's it guys, that's how you manage and how you work with VORs or navigation radios in this Kinair 350. I hope you like it, if you like it please uh, hit the like and subscribe, give me any comments and leave me any questions that you want them to have addressed. That's it for now guys, thank you for watching, until the next time.